everybody, it's Christina of Crafty Paws. I wanted to do a video to share with you guys the ornaments that I've been making to catch up on all the days that I missed while I've been traveling uh, away from home without my crafty goodies. So the first one is actually just, <laughs> it's a little uh, skating dog. Um, and I actually thought it was a poodle when I bought this little guy. Um, but the tail, as you can see, shows that it's not. Um, but it was um, a present that a friend of mine gave to me years ago. And I just altered it a little bit, adding these flowers that were um, gifted to me or, or in my prize package from Heather, who is Ideas to Come. And then I added these little felt hearts on the ends. And those are from... Uh, my swap package from Jen, who's Scrapina Creations. Uh, and I also added just to the top here a little red bell that also came from Jen. Thank you, ladies. Um, and I really think that this little skating dog is so cute. Um, the next one is an altered frame. And I put a picture of me and Bandito when we had gone to a charity ball for an animal shelter. Um, this frame is part of my price package from Heather and I altered it adding this little tag from uh, a sticker pack that was gifted to me by Jen and in the little eyelet hole there I added uh, one of those Tim Holtz um, metal brad um, embellishments that I thought kind of looked like a metal poinsettia I don't know how to pronounce that poinsettia poinsettia Anyway, um, and then at the bottom, I added this lace um, trim that came from Lisa, who's Maggie 2005 Cupcake, and I just uh, looped through these, um, the little holes in this lace, uh, some red ribbon, so I thought that would make it nice and festive, um, and I have a loop in the back made of the same ribbon to hang from the tree. Um, the next three ornaments are all from these little metal pails that are holders for um, party favors, I think for like weddings or something. And the three pails are um, part of my uh, winnings from Heather, Ideas to Come. And I decorated the first one using some blue lace and these um, aqua flowers with the beautiful stamen. Um, and that, and both of those I got from Rose, who is cutesy girly here on YouTube. Then I trimmed the top with these beautiful blue, uh, fabric roses. Um, and then the front with this beautiful paper, um, florette that had these really cute flying reindeer. And both the rose trim as well as this paper florette are from Lisa, who's Maggie 2005 Cupcake. Um, and I just added uh, some white satin ribbon to make these little bows on the side and also to have the hanging portion of the little pail. And I'm not sure what I'm gonna put in the pail. Um, if I can locate like little tiny stuffed animals or something like that, I thought that might be cute um, if I could find some doggy ones to put in there. Um, so that one's all done in blues, and this one I did in all pinks, and I just love the way how lush it came out. Um, sorry if I'm making you guys a little dizzy there. I started again with a little metal pail, and then I did a double layer of this crocheted lace um, that was gifted to me by Rose, uh, cutesy girly. And she also gifted me this um, pink flatback pearls, um, the big one, and the big pink flowers with a gorgeous stamen, the little pink flowers. Um, hopefully that'll focus. Um, there we go. Um, as well as, um, so the little pink flowers as well as the little white flowers are all from my package from Heather, Ideas to Come, and she also has a store, so I will um, 
put a link in the description box to her store so you can check out her beautiful flowers and trims and things. Um, I added this um, silhouette cameo that was gifted to me by Rose. And then just to add a little doggy touch, I added this little Maltese and this little Bichon, just because they were little cute white dogs. And those were gifted to me by Kim, who's Kimber Creations. Thank you, Kim. Um, and I just really like how lush and beautiful this came out. It just looks like it's bursting with these flowers. Um, oh, and I added also my the last of this little um, blingy pink flower. That was also from um, Rose. And lastly, totally different style now. I took the last pail and made it totally doggy themed. Um, first, I wrapped the whole thing with... Um, kind of it's not grow grain it's kind of almost like a burlap uh ribbon and actually it just came from the packaging from some ikea furniture that i had um and i just uh washed it out and made sure i got rid of all of the dust and i dried it and then i cut it up and um kind of distressed the edges because i wanted kind of that rough hewn look I used a little bit of this Merry Christmas um, ribbon that I got from Michaels and then I just went crazy and added all these um, dog heads and full dogs uh, that were gifted to me uh, by Kim of Kimber Creations and she also gifted this wolf and the little paws um, and it just has all different kinds of dogs. Hopefully my camera will refocus. But I really like how that came out. It's very, uh, it's very me, Crafty Paws. <laughs> um, and uh, in the middle I added an extra little tie just so I could add this wolf and the paws. Um, anyway, so those are my new, my latest uh, Christmas tree ornaments. I hope you guys are having a great weekend, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.